what do you think the strangest weapon in Splatoon is? My personal vote is going towards the sloshing machine, which is a washing machine filled with ink that will probably stain your clothes. Now, this weapon is in the slosher category and fires kind of one-ish projectile. Um, it does a really good amount of damage. It has some decent range and it comes equipped with fizzy bombs and a booyah bomb. So, I'm going to take this weapon through some turf war and some anarchy battles and then give my thoughts on it at the end. So without further ado, now please remember, I suck at this game. So, uh, uh, pretty much every- you know, no, I have confidence in myself today. I have great confidence. Oh! This is not anarchy, I've only ever played this map in anarchy for some reason. It's like my favorite anarchy map just in general. Actually, it's probably my favorite map in general. Uh, hey man, where- where- where are you throwing that bomb from? I don't really... Approve of you bombing right now. Okay. I'm rushing you, friend. Okay, the booyah bomber right there. That's gotta get him. Sweet. If these people win and they gotta disconnect, then I will just humbly admit that they are all better than me at the game. Okay, apparently they're not going to get a win, which kind of makes sense. Man, I hate it when there's a disconnect, and I'm- and I- even when I win, because then it just doesn't feel good. I mean, I get the XP, but it just doesn't feel good. I don't feel like I really won. No, stop range blastering me. I don't like it. You can't do- the go away. You're not allowed. Uh, no! Uh, and boom. Okay, at least I got him. Oh my gosh, I hate you so much. This weapon is awesome. You know, I am not using my my sub at all. And boom. Right there. Get out of here. You have been distracted. Get him, get him. You're, I, oh my gosh, I need to use motion controls. I need to man up and finally use motion controls. Dude, this guy can die. Kudos. Johnny the J can dodge. That man can juke. A squid kid. <laughs> You're not a squid or a kid. You're actually made out of crystal. Thanks for watching Chris's review of the Alterna logs. You know what? I am getting... I'm zoning out in the wrong way in Splatoon. I'm zoning out and just inking tiny little spots. Booyah, I need to go do other things besides inking the same tiny little spots. Come here. I have a slosher too, except mine is made out of a washing machine. No. How dare you? No. My friend. And me. Wabbit. Can I just say, one of the most amazing, like, quality of life features in this Splatoon game is being able to buy weapons before you are actually at that level. Oh, nice one, guys. You guys got Wabbit real good. Alright, boys. Here we go. It's time to clam. Clam, clam, clam. Look for clam. I'm wa I want a clam. <laughs> Give me some clam. I'm a clam. How do you already have a football? That's not funny. You're not funny. This isn't a funny joke. What is happening? How do you? What on earth? How do you? This is what? How? But yeah, how? I don't know. The explain. I need it. I need the. I need explanation. This isn't good. No, stop him. Oh my goodness, that was too close. I see uh, the clams in sight. Target locked. I see clams. I'm clamming so hard. I have enough. I have enough things to clam. Oh no, he's got one of those funny little things. No, you're gone. You're out of here. You're, you're gone. No more. You're not allowed. No more. Ooh, okay. No. N no. No, no Clash Blaster. No Clash. Oh, oh, oh. oh my goodness, so oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh, oh my. And now I'm going to give my thoughts on the sloshing machine. So, let's start with Turf War. Overall, it's a solid 4 out of 5 for Turf War. It is not the best at inking turf. However, it is a beast at dealing with enemy players. 
this thing can two-shot pretty much anybody, and since Ink Armor is removed from the game, that's gonna stay pretty consistent. It has some really nice range, with a little bit of AoE on the side, and overall, it's a good weapon. Its only downside, like I said, is that it's not the best at inking turf. Now, for Anarchy Battle, I give the Sloshing Machine a solid 5 out of 5. With having to focus on inking turf kind of out of the question, it really allows it to shine as the PvP master that it really is. It can do a lot of damage at a decent speed, and it has that little bit of AoE damage to help thin out some crowds. The Fizzy Bomb can be helpful, and its Booyah Bomb is... It's amazing. It, it goes so well with it. Overall, for Anarchy, it's a great choice. Finally, how much fun is it? For me, it's only a 3 out of 5, but keep in mind, this is my opinion. This is not facts, I'm no pro player, this is just my opinion. My playstyle tends to be fast-paced and switching from mid-range mid combat to close-range combat as quick as possible. The sloshing machine tends to kind of stay comfortably at the mid-range combat area and doesn't really do too good at close-range combat. And it can often be a bit on the slow side. However, it's still extremely formidable, just not as fun for me to play as other weapons. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to like, subscribe, and all that other things, that YouTube things. And comment down below what else you want to see. And I'll see you next time.